Hi guys, welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, we're doing collect all pets and game updates. So, first of all, the first thing that happened was we've got the new area. Grove is awesome. You literally have all the eggs in this area. So it goes from common all the way to prodigious. We've got this, and also over here, we have metallic luck, which is good. And here we've got the metallic leaderboard. Gravy MC 3. Three. Th 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 three. So you've got two scorpions and one skeleton mage, I'm pretty sure. That's what he has. Insane. How many? Is it, there's still places 28. 28 has gone up one for that short time. Okay. Awesome. I haven't got any, sadly. My shiny score is so close. So if we look at this, that looks amazing. But what I mean so close? I mean so close to this. Look how close it is. 12 more. Also, new things added, they've now all been completed. So, metallic score, that's new. You've now got all these, all that, all this, this. I got this one, jobs collected, but I think that's the only one I got. But yeah, awesome. Also, okay, that's basically this area, what's happened. So, there's now that, and I recommend buying this um, 75 metallic polished metal thing when you have a metallic pet because other than that it's doing absolutely nothing for you the number of skins you have for a metallic pet it gets a damage multiplier so get it when you have a pet and if you don't even have any if you have no shiny skins of that pet don't do it as well because it's not going to do anything until you get a shiny skin you can do it and then the next big thing was the new area and the lag see these new jobs you get rings and crates and all that it helps reduce the lag so if we come over here we've got the brand new what the the basically station area so we've got all these which i haven't felt like buying you've got generation station classification station i don't know how to pronounce it automation station i've got all the plane stations i've upgraded this so far so it might and this one, so my goal at the moment is just to upgrade this to 100, buy that, do this up to 150, buy that, 200, buy that, just to keep, just go back and forth between them. And also there's a couple new upgrades up here, so you, we now have, so I maxed out this and I got Expert's Luck. So that's my new, sh got some extra shiny luck f on your pets, on your total pet score. I brought gold hoarder as well, because I've, look at all, my area's looking really good, and I got mega damage. But yeah, so if we come over here, I bought 1% on mega damage. Just one, just one, just one. I didn't need any more, I think one was good enough for me. So if we just click this, yeah, this can now go up to 100%. Um, the magnet can go up to 800, so you could go into a lot of different areas and collect drops. So this can go up to 800, and then if we come to the speed, you can't get any more of that. But if we come over here, oops, you can now get this up to 300, which I got once. But I don't want to do it anymore. There's also a damage leaderboard, so by the time number one, you need 5,868 to get on it. I'm not quite there. This is my best team as well. Looking really good. Slowly, slowly gonna eventually get a full mythical team when I'm at that level. So these stations are awesome. So you've got, let's just get over here. So you've got the generation station, which with those areas, those um, side things you can buy and you can select to generate and you can only do one at a time and you can turn off and on, you can showcase pet if shiny so that means it just comes up onto your screen here metallic, I've show of course I've got it on showcase because I want to see it if I get it and you can mute the sound but I like listening to it Automate, automatically equips best pets and automatically fuses pets that aren't equipped so now that this game pass fusel is basically useless, you now get a gold multiplier when buying it. So if you want a gold multiplier, buy the fuse machine. If you just want more gold multiplier, but you need this as well. Convert. So this is sort of making the game less paid to win, which is really cool. And also you've got calcifier, which is automatically converts unequipped mythicals into mythical storage, which is really good. So this one you can just do all at once which is usually what you do when you join and just want to get it going but yeah so 
what was I gonna say? Yeah, I heard people talking about, uh, let's go into shop, that buying this is basically useless because it's not even that good. But what I thought was good about this is that it makes the game less paid to win. And also, if you're new and starting off the game, you can get through the start of the game really quickly. Which, that's why I think this is quite good. So if you're just starting out, you can buy this and get through the start of the game quickly. But it's not paid to win for this early game. Because with two times weekend, I'm making over a million a second. Which is really good. Um, there's nothing much else. You've got this. Uh, yes, you got the metallic skins. Oh, we'll go over to do the, see the metallic damage. So, they do insane damage. So, I'm pretty sure the best team you can have is just a full titanium team of mythicals and then ascendants. Because you can only get one of each. You can't get more. So, if we come here, titanium mythical does 2,000 damage. Okay? So, if you got titanium mythical, and that is basically 24,000 damage. Just, just, it will be under, probably be more around, wait, yeah, it would be 23,700 damage, but, but this is just base damage, it does even more damage, see here, just a plain shiny mythical does 144, but with my upgrades here and this, uh, here, it does 483, so when you think about that, that is doing like three times that, so that means this will be doing like more than, more like 6,000 to 7,000 damage. This is going to be even more insane than what it looks here, because this is just the base damage. This is one mythical, if I had one mythical titanium, I would be on the top of this leaderboard. No, I would be in the top, top 10. I'd be in the top 10. I'm pretty sure I'd be in the top 10 if I just had one which is insane, and it's also insane to think one chrome common is better than a shiny mythical. That's insane. That's why I'm, that's why my goal at the moment is to increase my um, speed of automation and my um, calcify the calcify luck to give a chance of receiving an extra mythical stone when calcified mythic. This is to increase the speed of generation, which I'm working on now. I'm not going to buy that now, I'll buy that later. Ooh, nice, I've lord. And then these, these are just basically the... That can be selected in the gener generation station. Yeah, that's awesome. So, yeah. And also, I'm going to start getting my mega damage upgrade. I'll be working on that more. You got all the you got extended damage and mega damage. It's like you got cheaper eggs and then even cheaper eggs, and you don't need a rebirth anymore basically. So my pet score isn't probably going to go up that significantly, but it will because you I'll do at least one rebirth a day. I've already done one today, but I'll probably reach forty thousand today, which will be a cool goal. But let's just come over here and look at this leaderboard one more time, and then I think we'll finish off the video. Oh wait, there's one more place we want to look at after this. So it's insane how many people. Oh, another person. While we're doing the video, another person got a metallic. Wow, that's insane. There should be like a um a global thing when you get a titanium. That'd be insane. You get a titanium pet and it goes global. Okay, let's go over here. There's one more new thing in here, and then that's it. We now have magneto magnetosphere. So earn an extra quick. Earn an exotic crystal luck multiplier based on your metallic score. So whatever your metallic score is divided by 100, you'll get a uh, boost with. So, yeah, that's awesome. This I'm not working on now, definitely. Might as well just buy one of these, you know, for the video. There we go, 0 0.4. That's good. But yeah. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about the game, please put it in the comments and I'll answer them. Or if maybe I feel like it's a good question, I'll do a video on it. I hopefully guys you enjoyed this update and it was insane. And hopefully I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye.